Thanks, thanks, Mel Orla. Um, welcome, everybody. I'm delighted to, to be here with you all today. Um, I have a wee formal speech to do, um, so I'm, just so that I can thank everybody and, and uh, mention all the key people. Delighted to be here this morning, meeting some of the leaders. One of the key objectives of the County Arts Strategy is to develop an environment that supports artists in exploring their creativity and to produce ambitious works of art. The Council supports this through these three bursary award schemes. We've worked in collaboration with the Halpins for a number of years. I'm delighted to welcome you here today, Mr. Halpin. More recently with Music Generation South Dublin to support the musical development of young musicians and singers in the county through the Annette Halpin Memorial Award. I'd like to thank both Andy Halpin and his family and Music Generation for their generosity. Through the Individual Artist Bursary Scheme and the Young Artist Development Award, the Council supports both professional development and the development of practice of emerging and established artists. We must nurture and support our resident artists who are a key element of a vibrant cultural ecosystem in this county. The artists have many roles as creators, facilitators, presenters and collaborators and their contribution to local arts sustainability cannot be underestimated. For the recipients of these awards, the impact can be far reaching and opening doors to other opportunities. And we do ask you to let us know how the award impacts on you as an artist and on your career development. This year, 11 awards have been made totaling €15,300 in the categories of music, literature, visual arts, in amounts ranging from €300 to €200,000. €2,000, sorry, €200,000. I'd, like <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to congratulate each and every one of you on your achievements. I look forward to seeing your work in the future. Thanks, everybody, for coming along today.